Okay, so we're back with another section. So let's go ahead and take a look at this. Um, really all I'm trying to do is prove that angles are equal to each other. Um, so like two and four are equal to each other because there, can, there are vertical angles. And then um, six is congruent here because six and two are alternate interior angles. And then um, six is congruent to 136. So there are alternate interior angles that are congruent. Corresponding angles, so like in this case, one and five are congruent and alternate exterior angles would be like one and eight, and those are also congruent, okay? So given to this angle 72 here, two is, is congruent because they're vertical, alternate interior makes five, and then vertical angle is seven here, okay? All right, so now um, I wanna take a look at one solving one before I have you guys solve some on your own. So I'm gonna flip the page here. I want to look at this question seven down here. Drop in more papers. Okay, so these lines are parallel. And these two make a linear pair. That means that 3x minus 20 plus 2x is equal to 180. So 5x minus 20 is equal to 180. 5x is equal to 200. So x is equal to 40, okay? That makes 40 here, so that makes this 80. Because it's a linear pair, that makes this a 100. And then x here, so then put 40 here, so 80 uh, minus minus 15 is 65. Okay. All right, so let's try some on your own now. Let's go ahead and do that. Um, let's look at one through four. And then let's look at nine here mm. and we can do 13 also okay so one two three four nine and 13 so go ahead pause the video and then we'll come back and take a look all right so we're back which ones are congruent to 132 angle three angle five so three is vertical five is alternate interior seven because five and seven are vertical. 67, so four is congruent because they're vertical, two because of alternate interior, and that's it. Here, 88, so five, three, and one. Five because they're vertical, three because of alternate interior, and one because they're vertical. 43, two, alternate interior is five, and another vertical is six, okay? All right, so now angle one and angle two is what we're trying to find. One and three are linear, or sorry, what one and one thirty are linear pair. So linear pair makes one hundred eighty degrees. So one thirty minus one eighty is fifty. Okay, and then angle two is one hundred and thirty because they are corresponding. 13, so 13, 2 makes a linear pair, so 135 plus 45 is um, 180, so that makes a linear pair, and then alternate interior angles, so this is 45 because of alternate interior angles, okay? And that is it for this section.